Russian team in the first round of presidential elections in Montenegro, the president of the Democratic Party of Socialists, Milo Djukanovic, won 35.3% of the votes, and Yakov Milatovic, whose movement Europe now has no parliamentary status, won 29.2% of the votes. The candidates were diverse. An influencer without a day of political experience, Jovan Radulovic, the current president with 30 years in power in his biography, several of his opponents, besides Milatovic, Andrea Mandic from For the Future of Montenegro, Goran Danilovic, United Montenegro, Alexa Becic, Democratic Montenegro, and one female candidate, Dragina Vuksanovic Stankovic from Social Democratic Party of Montenegro. This indeed briefly describes the starting position um, for the uh, president of Montenegro. The second round is scheduled on April 2nd. Both rounds of presidential elections are held in a time of institutional and political crisis. The current government lost confidence in the parliament seven months ago. Several attempts to form a new one failed, which is why Djukanovic announced early par parliamentary elections for June 11. The results of the second round of presidential elections, in which Milo Djukanovic and Jakub Milatovic will be present, will have an impact on the upcoming parliamentary elections, which could lead to overcomposition on the political scene of Montenegro.